Okay, so this is Guess the One Piece Devil Fruit. So there's three things you have to guess. There's the name of the character, the name of their what what their powers are, and then the name of the devil fruits. Okay? This is my friend. She has doesn't know she knows almost nothing about One Piece. She yep. knows Luffy and the Skeleton. That's it. Yeah. So we'll start. I have examples, two examples. Here's Name, Luffy, Power, He's Rubber, Devil Fruit, Gum Gum Fruit. An example two. Name, Ace, Power, Can Create and Become Fire. Devil Fruit, Flame Flame Fruit. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's now here's the first one. Uh, I doubt his name relates to his power. Is that a he or a she? I, sh I don't think I should say anything. I think that's a girl. I can hardly tell. Looks like a girl. Looks like, um, kind of looks like she has, like, weed pants. <laughs> you get some <laughs> those are supposed to be green flowers. Flowers. Uh, Floria or something like that because okay. of the flowers on her. <laughs> or she, she has, like, weird Floria. hair, so maybe she's a clown. Um... <laughs> It's not what she normally looks like, I'll say that much. But I know she must be some sort of like, what are they called? The digging animals. I don't remember what that's called. I don't know if I'm, I don't think I should say anything. Yeah, yeah, I, I, I'm gopher. Gopher. Okay. Gopher, gopher fruit. Or dig, dig fruit. Okay. Well, what are those? Is the fruit. So, do it, Floria. Floria? Okay. Dig dig fruit or go for go for fruit. Okay, so I'll tell you now. Okay, it's her name's Miss Merry Christmas. Oh, 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 and her power she can dig, obviously. Her name's Miss Merry Christmas. Oh, she has a Christmas tree tie. That's I was thinking Christmas, but I thought that that was a little odd. Um, she works for an organization where all the girls are named holidays and the boys are named numbers. Oh, okay. I know it's weird. Um. Miss Mary Chris and her, her partner is Mr. Four. Her, um, and so her power is she can turn into a mole. Oh, it's a mole, <laughs> not a gopher. I thought you were going to say badger. Uh, yeah. There are a lot of digging That's animals, why she doesn't though. normally look like that. Okay. Uh, oh, man, it's just like the mole, mole fruit. Well, I was close. I said gopher, yeah. gopher. Give me the point. I think that counts enough. Okay, you got the right power, though. Here's the next one. This is really dumb. Kristen. Oh, my gosh. Uh, a bat bow man. That's obviously not his name, but that's what he looks like. He the looks bow like is not his little power. bit like a weapon. Bowser <laughs> with the shoulder thingies. Um, that's his shirt. That's part of his shirt. I think. Uh, the bat bat fruit. <laughs> okay, and what's his name? <laughs> I don't think he's a part of the same organization that she was. No, he's not. He's, he's a not. newer character, if you can tell by character. the... Yeah, because he's not in the anime yet. No, he is, but he... There wasn't... It was oh. like... He was in, like, one of the newer episodes. Mm. And, so, and there wasn't any good pictures for that. Okay, that's why you... There wasn't a full body shot. A picture, okay. Yeah. Uh... The names... Very recent The character. names are difficult to do because... Okay, he... His power is that he can fly like a bat... Or he can become a bat. Or he can become a bat, yeah, because obviously those wings. But and he head. doesn't look exactly like a bat, but his, like, half of his head does. Look and at the ears. Do you see his ears? His ears and his feet. Do you um, see his ears? His feet. Do, you see, do you notice? Mm -hmm. They're really big. So I guess it's a bat power, so bat, yeah. bat fruit. What's his um, name? And his name. You're going to laugh when you hear his name. Is Bing Bo, because he yeah. has a bow. And for some reason, I'm thinking, like, Bing Bong from Inside Out. Okay. <laughs> I don't He's, know. He's, his name, you're gonna laugh, it's Batman. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I was thinking that too when I looked at him. I said, it's Batman. <laughs> I was actually thinking it, but I didn't say that because yeah. I also, I thought that was so like too Batman, strange. So he, he can, uh, he has like the bat hearing and he can fly. Okay. So Two things. What's the fruit called? Bat fruit? Yeah, you're right. You're correct. It's called bat fruit or bat bat, bat fruit? Well, it's kind of unnamed, but yeah. Okay. But it's just in this next one. Here's a hint oh, for no. this one. Extra third picture for a hint. But it's too obvious, so I saved it for. Is it's, he turn into metal? 
It's something in both metal? pictures. It's hard to see in the, in the left one. I can't tell if that's metal or he's like turning invisible or if that's like his skeleton or he's turning into like a ghost type thing. And what's that sword thingy? Is that a sword or a that's tentacle? A sword. Somebody's okay. hitting with a sword. It's some sort of like metal armory thing. And because I can't think of a name and I know fairy tale, his name is Gajiel <laughs> and his power is. Uh, what, metal? It's not metal. It's some sort of, like, shieldy metal. But it, I don't know if it's metal metal. It doesn't look like metal. What, what do you see in, is different about him in the left picture? In the left picture, his hand is, like, sort of metal-y. Finger. Maybe he's, like, robot. Ro, ro, he looks okay, also where was foot? like a cyborg. And there's, like, a spike coming out of his foot. It's a skate. A skate! Ah! Is that ice? No. You think you can block the sword with ice? No, but I was like, there's a skate, so maybe, um... Well, skates aren't made of ice. Yeah, but skates it would relate metal. to what blade, he's doing. Blade, skate, blade is metal. Ah! <laughs> but his hand doesn't turn into a blade. But it is kind of like a claw, like, like, um... I was going to say Thor, but I know it's not Thor, it's... You want the hint picture? No, oh, no, no, it's no, gonna no. wait. It's too obvious. So that's it's why gonna I saved be too it. obvious. But like right now, that's why I, saved I, it. I, I can just tell that he has some sort of metally power. I'll let you guess it, and then I'll show you the hint, and it's, you can re-guess. Yeah, yeah. Um, for now, I'm gonna call him Gajiel. His power is metal transforming, and <laughs> his fruit is metal metal fruit. No, okay. Here's a hint. What? I'm confused. I'm more confused than I was before. What is that? It's his fingers. Obviously. <laughs> but what? He did use his power. I'm trying to figure out what that is supposed to be. I was thinking, is it like a skeleton y, tentacle y thingy? But it's not. Honestly, I'm more confused with that picture than I was He's with the other one. He's doing the same ones. thing as in the other two pictures. So that's not metal. That's like a... Well, it could be. That's not metal, though. <laughs> metal isn't purple and it's glowy. It's not purple, it's just shiny. But that's not shiny. There's like purple stripes. Oh, just different. Well, it looks just... like a, a, like tentacles more than it looks like um. It's just regular fingers. Metal. I mean, he just made them something else partially. Something else partially. Is he like a goop? Like a goop man? Or like, like a, like, I don't, honestly, I don't know. I, I think I'm going to have to go with the first one I said, because okay. I, I honestly have no clue what that is. His name, okay, so you done? Mm -hmm. Gajiel, his name's not Gajiel. <laughs> Obviously. His name's Mr. One. Miss, oh, he's part of the... Yeah. Okay. I, I think it says on his... Has the tattoo says one or something like that. I don't actually know. It's he basically can turn his power, makes his body like blades on his. So it's like a blade arm, blade fingers. Like these oh, blades on his foot to for be this blades? case. Blades. Yeah, sharp. But then why is it white too? It's shiny. It's like then it's why metal. Is That's it why purple? you can see. Rough, I don't know. So it was metal, but why is it like purpley? Just that picture kind of threw me off. Okay. Well, I didn't think the color, the dark part, really meant anything. Um, yeah, and his, his fruit is called the the dice dice fruit, like, you know, slice and dice. Oh, that's the first <laughs> one that, like, sort of didn't really relate to anything. It's, well, what you, else would you call it? Metal metal. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> it's, it's, make, it's cool. Um, this guy's really obvious. Ooh. It's still an easy one. Uh, it's like a diamond mining power. Like, his so arm is a like name. a diamond. He looks like a, like a, like a very, like, muscular, like... I know, but that's not his power. <laughs> oh, no, but I mean, like, name-wise, name like... Yeah. He also has a very big neck. Like Boris. Okay, Boris. Boris, he looks like a <laughs> Boris. Um, Japanese Boris. Or something like that. Um, or, like... Like... Something with a B. Like, something like a very, like, striking name. Um, and 
he's obviously has like diamond diamond powers like i don't really know sort of like mining powers because he's like digging mm-hmm. in the ground sort of but oh it's that's just, so just oh this is from a video game a gotcha game you summoned him that's just his artwork oh okay so then it is like it's a, not actually making it is smoke like a diamond thing going on like it don't bother the smoke and whatever it's not digging is he a bad guy or a good guy Neutral. Neutral. Okay, so he's not part of that organization. Um, so I can't call him Mr. Boris or anything like that. No, there's only one more person with that organization. Okay. He's coming up. I think I might be able to tell now. Um, well, if you see a number on them. Is that like... Are those diamonds? I'm gonna call him... No, he's is Boris. He a, Boris? It's either diamond, diamond, fruit, or mine, mine, So it's his fruit. power. And his power is the diamond power. He like, turns he turns into diamond? into diamond. Okay. So, his name's Jozu? Jozu. Like, Diamond Jozu. Because it turns into diamond. Oh. And his fruit, it doesn't have an English name, but the Japanese name is, like, the sound effect for sparkling gems. Oh. And it's like Kira Kira. Yeah. Kira Kira fruit. But the English name is un- doesn't have one. Like, they never, for some reason, that, di- that line of dialogue where they said his name, they didn't say the name of the fruit in the English one for well, some reason. I guess they don't have a word for it. Yeah, they just never named it. There's the next one. There's a hint for this one because it's too obvious. Oh, oh, this is the guy part of the organization because he has also something written on his chest. Oh, no, that's just his um, pirate, no. fly, pirate flag. Oh, I thought there was something to do with the tap. No, he's the guy he really likes. Mm. He wants to join him, but he's that guy, he's too weak to join him. But he has that it's guy's, like, pirate flag. creepy flag. Okay. There's a pirate flag on his chest. It looks reason. like Even Luffy he, if he was blonde and became the Hulk. He also has really long legs. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to call him Buffy. Buffy because he's a buff okay. Luffy who's blonde. It's actually kind of close. Really? Uh, and then he starts with a B. And, <laughs> well, I was not very close with Boris, so I guess I'm going with B names now. And... That's, I can't tell what that, is that Don't, iron? his arm is, doesn't mean anything, just oh, so you know. Oh. The arm is, is black, but it's like, not his power. Oh my gosh, okay, well that, that's confusing. <laughs> he looks like, I guess, like a, he has like a G, maybe he can transform giant. But he's already very big, so that doesn't make any sense. His hands are huge. That's um, just the camera angle. I honestly... Is there any indication in this picture of what his yes. power is? The one thing that's not normal. I'm trying to like play like <laughs> that's spot not the, the difference between the this picture arm. and the second picture. There's a hint, but it's it gives it away, so I, it's like too obvious. There's sparks in the air. Maybe that's, the no, that's, sparks have that's to That's just do? he landed really hard. Oh on the my floor gosh! <laughs> and his arm, the the left arm, has literally nothing to do with anything. Even right arm. Right arm, yeah. My left. Um, <laughs> maybe his tongue? Oh, wait, 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 wait. For some reason, he's wearing glasses in the first picture and not oh, glasses in the second that's one. That's just because he probably got beat up in between. Oh, I'm playing spot the difference. And that's it should all. be obvious. His feet. Springs, springs, springs on his feet. He jumps. He's a jumpy man. <laughs> okay. I think. So, Buffy, let's see what... Buffy, uh, jumping here's man. Here's picture. Yeah, he's a jumping man. Good, good. Jumping I man. I told you he gives it away. Buffy the jumping man. Okay. And his power... His No, sorry, not his power. Because his power devil is a jumping fruit. man. And his devil fruit is spring, spring fruit. Okay, so his name is Bellamy. Oh, I was close to that. I, I actually... In the E part, too. Bellamy the hyena. That's why his tongue like that. Okay. Um... And his this is spring spring fruit. He can turn his any part of his body into a spring. For, That's the closest yeah. one. That's the closest one. I did. I well, it's it obvious. Perfect. It just can. No, but I did yeah. all three. Even with his you name. said his power is to jump, but it's actually his power to become springs, which allow him to jump. Well, it's still jumping. <laughs> it's a res- it's yeah. Springs on his feet. So I know. Well, still- he can put his arms too for punching better. Oh. Punching farther and stronger. Um. So does he have springs oh. on his arm? If he wants to make them, he can make it. He can make can his. Can he torso. have springs on his neck too? Yeah, he can. He can turn any part of his body to a spring. Cool. It just one but use of it is jumping. But then why is the hand like that? It's kind of it's complicated. Okay. 
But oh. it's not important. Oh. This one's ob- not obvious, but... Not obvious. She has, like, a... Oh, okay, she has a bunch of girls that always follow her. Just... Uh, those aren't... Those don't mean anything. That's okay. why they're in... This is the same game. I cannot tell if You've your power game a lot. is to turn people into clothes and hang them. <laughs> or... Or if her power is some sort of cloud-related thing. No, that's just... They didn't bother drawing your whole body in the artwork. Oh. So the cloud-related thing is, like, nothing. It's just a... You know, it's from a, it's from a video you okay. saw, you know, gotcha game. Mm-hmm. So, she's holding something in her hand. As she's talking to someone. It's like a oh, radio. Oh, so it's like radio. Okay. Except they use snails in one piece for talking. It's hard. It's complicated. And interesting. Are they like alive though? Yeah, they're like telepathic snails. So you talk to one and they. Cape, her cape might have to do with her power. No, just she's a high-ranking person. Oh, oh, okay. She's a navy person. See the see what that girl has on her hat. And she put them on a clothing uh, rack, and there's like and there, sparkles all around her. So she just did something with her power. Well, do you see what? Yeah. But. A power to turn people into clothes and hang them on a rack. Sounds very, very strong. strange and specific. It's pretty strong, don't you think? I think it's very strange and specific. I would say strong well, too, yeah. but also <laughs> like that's odd. But I've seen. Well, weird do you notice know, anything? How are they being held up? By clothing pins. pins. You, that wouldn't work on normal people, right? So then, like. She flattens them. She magically flattens them, and hangs them on a hanger thingy. Okay, so what's her name, by the way? Her name is Beatrice. I'm okay. using B names. No, I can't do that. I just did a B name last time. I'm not going to do that again. It's not a B I have name. to think of another that. name. Romelda. <laughs> Romelda. <laughs> she, she looks, looks like a Romelda. Uh, that's better than a real name, I think. Okay. <laughs> and she's an old woman. I can, yeah, that's pretty obvious. With the power to flatten people. What's that already called? And hang them on a clothing rack. And the fruit is called. It's called. Imagine the punishment of putting them in a washing machine. <laughs> how how bad that would be. I bet you that happens. Does that happen? <laughs> She's barely in. I mean, she barely ever fights. Okay. Probably. As you could tell. I'm trying to see what her power... I'm like, I mean, I'm, I think her power is like hanging people on clothing racks by flattening them. So the fruit would have to do with the flattening process or maybe the clothing pins. But the pin pin fruit, which I actually don't think because that sounds like <laughs> no. someone who has like the power to like make pins come out of themselves or like throw yeah. pins at people. So what do you think? Um, Rack rack fruit, but that doesn't sound very appropriate. <laughs> <I'm> <laughs> <seeing that. laughs> like loving racks. Okay. But um no, no. What's a way word for flattening someone? I'm trying to think Iron. of like a No, but that would also wouldn't work. That wouldn't work either. Because that's more like burning someone and flattening okay. them. Um just say something. You probably I'm won't thinking get of it. something. Um Flat flat fruit. I don't know. Okay. So her name is Suru the Great Tactician. What did I say her name was? Beatrice? No, you changed it. Romelda, Romelda, Romelda yeah. okay. Um, her power is like, she washes them. Oh, dry, she Dry, she cleans washes them. Th- so she cleans people? Like, they're, uh, they she turns cleans them their like, evil and intentions clean. and stuff. Oh. Evil, washes evil away. Oh, that makes sense. Um, pretty good for a government person. And it's called the wash wash fruit. Oh, come on, I, I messed up, and you even said something about imagine you put them in a oh, washing, machine. washing machine. I should have got that. Imagine how, what would it be like to be in a washing machine, though? <laughs> does she flatten them, though, or is that like... That's just like off-screen happens. Like I don't that. really know. That happens off-screen when she's okay. introduced. Like, she just introduced, and these people are behind her. Mm-hmm. Like, you know, she never does it ever again, because she, like, is always a talking person. Okay. Um, this one is funny. There's a hint for this one. She's holding cabbage. She likes cabbages. <laughs> yeah, she has a paintbrush. She has a paintbrush. She has the same power that the guy in Scribble Knots has. She can make things with her paintbrush. What's her name? That's her power, though. Like, you see that bird behind her? 
That looks like something that she drew. The cabbage she's holding, she definitely painted that. So her name, I don't really know. She looks like... Like a really like, I'm giving her like a really strange like sweet name, thinking of like something like that because it would be funny. Um, well, it looks pretty Japanese that person, right? She does because she has. Um, actually, I don't know. Does she? She looks normal to me. Well, as normal as the characters in One Piece well, go. Well, I'll tell you this: it's like face paint. It's not actually. Oh, so like. Um, well, I think it's face. -paint. I actually don't know. Okay. Clara, because kind of sounds like... Okay. Because I'm thinking, I'm thinking of an, a real name. But also, to, she's a clown, so I You don't have to name it. the fruit because it's unnamed um, in the show. I mean, you know, name Clara, it, does, she doesn't look like Clara at all. She looks like... Um, Want me to tell you something? Sure. That's actually a boy. That's a boy. Okay, okay. <laughs> I thought she looked like a boy because she has a very striking <laughs> jaw. But I didn't want to say anything. And she also has a really good smile. Yes, lovely smile. Um, so then should we be calling him he? Yeah. Okay. So his name does he go by a girl name or a boy name? Uh, I don't know. It's Japanese name. Okay. Well, then I can't really name this person because I don't really know you any can Japanese come up with a name. names. I'm going to come up with... I think Probably like boy. A gender neutrally more masculine name. Hmm. Hmm. Something with an R for some reason. I'm drawn to a name with an R for this person. Uh... Ricky. Okay. Ricky. Ricky. Cause so, Ricky. Ricky, and they have a paintbrush power some, somewhat similar to Scribble Lots uh -huh. in the sense that they can create So here's things. the hint. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. I need to give a fruit a name. Uh, okay. You don't have to name it, but you could because it's unnamed. Paint, this... paint, fruit, or like artist, artist. No, it's probably art, art, or like paint, paint, or, or something like that. But probably not sketch because it's not a pencil, it's a paintbrush. Okay. Well,. You think it's limited to just paint? Well, from what it looks like, that's a paintbrush. Their preference. And we were going to meet another hint yeah. by another photo. A cat? It looks like they drew that, too. I don't know how that helps me. Yeah, that's... It's the same thing, like... Yeah, maybe I shouldn't have made it a hint. Or maybe you're you're tricking me, and this is actually something very important, and their name has to do with cats. Nah, like it's cats. kind of. You just, it, they drew bird. I mean. So they did drew draw that. There's okay. a bird too. Yeah. I slipped my. Tongue. And they drew uh, a cabbage. They were hungry. <laughs> or, or probably that's. I bet you that's not a cabbage. That's something else, right? <laughs> no, nah, I think it's lettuce or cabbage. Yeah. Lettuce or cabbage. They were hungry. They made a bird because they wanted the bird <laughs> I to fight. I honestly don't know why they did And then that. they made a giant cat to ride on, like Appa, except yeah. it's a cat. So you got it right. It's just they draw. Their power is they, when they draw, it comes to life. And her, his name is Conjuro. Oh, because they conjure up things. I. No, because that would be the English word for conjure. But that actually works, because yeah. they okay. conjure up But the drawback things. is the person is really bad at drawing. I actually, I can see what they're going for there, but at the same time, <laughs> pretty cute drawings. Yeah, they're just really bad, so it's like a pathetic little creature every time. But Aww, <laughs> I actually like their drawings. Everyone makes fun of him, but yeah. Is he good or bad? He's a good guy. He's a samurai. Also, oh, that's, that's why, why it's kind of like a samurai sword, but it's That's a, why I said he the face paint thing. Mm. But he might not. I don't know what that is. It's, it was black and white in the manga, so. Couldn't entirely tell. Oh, okay. oh no. Here's, He's picking his nose. 